Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Lauren. I'm a singer and a voice teacher, and today I'm reacting to Gigi Delana uh, and Gigi Vibes um, and their cover of Fly Me to the Moon. I love this song, it's such a classic, and I'm excited to hear her sing it. So if you're new here, um, please take a second to click that red subscribe button and help me grow my channel. That's the best way to support my channel and to make sure that I keep continuing to make this free content for you. And I've reacted to Gigi a lot, so you'll definitely see her videos here in the future as well. And also, if you already subscribed, also give this uh, video a thumbs up. That's what helps more people find this video in the YouTube algorithm. So. Without further ado, let's listen to Gigi. Okay, here we go, pressing play. Okay, really strong opening from her. This is a jazz standard. So this song has been done a million times, but I love that she already is bringing unique things to the song um, that I've never heard before. Unique runs, a very unique intro from the band as well. And she just is so confident. I love her style. Let's keep going. Awesome. Okay, so this is a great example of uh, when we talk about making the song your own, we're not always talking about adding a million riffs, although she is adding some, um, and we're not always talking about like changing the melody. A lot of times there's other ways to make this your own that really has more to do with the music dynamics of the song, which means how loud, medium, or soft you're singing. Versus, oh, and, and, and additionally, um, rhythm, right? She's changing a lot of the rhythm of, of the typical standard of this song, um, but it's, it's adding a lot of interest, but she's doing it while staying with the band, right? She definitely practiced those rhythms with the band. Otherwise, if you bust out totally new rhythms with a band that you've never practiced before, that could be a recipe for disaster. <laughs> Obviously, she's her band uh, all has expert musicians in it, but just trying to give you some ideas for if you wanted to sing this song, how you could play around with it as well. Okay, here we go with the piano solo, which is typical of this style. Hello. 
play among the stars I wanna see what spring is like on extremely impressive that is so difficult so she's mirroring the same um chord progression uh, as the verses uh, but she's definitely improvising this like that's not the same every time she does it wow 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 it, uh, scatting is one of the hardest things um definitely like a, a top tier skill um in singing and in jazz specifically um, and the way that she does it is very unique too. She uh, really keeps those vowels in almost like a rock uh, place in her mouth. Very bright, very um, pointed. And that's what we can hear her so well, even with all the instruments and obviously she's mic'd and everything too. Um, there's a lot of instruments around her and she's not pushing. So that's really important as well. Let's finish this out. Probably one last go through. Oh, I'm wrong. <laughs> it's over. <laughs> wow. Fly me to the Again, I was not expecting, obviously not expecting that ending there. Um, so unique, such a great musician. Her collaboration with this band is really impressive to me. Just as impressive as how great of a singer she is because she um, and, the, and they work together so well. And it's not e always easy to work with bands, uh, with jazz bands. Um, cause there's a lot of moving parts. There's a lot of solos. As we heard in this one, there was a piano solo and a guitar solo. She's knowing where to come in. She's not looking at them. Um, which, you know, whenever I'm singing with any kind of a jazz band, I'm like, I need to make eye contact with them, but she is so uh, tightly knit with them that she knows exactly when to come in and, and for this arrangement, what needs to be done. So, so impressive. Thanks for everyone who uh, recommended this video to me. I always appreciate hearing from you in the comments. So definitely leave me, 
leave me a hello, leave me a song request or, or a technique video request as well. I love hearing from you and I read all the comments, so be nice. But thanks for coming here today. If you liked this reaction video, don't forget to click subscribe. Please help me grow my channel and I'm almost to hit, about to hit that 50K finally and give this video a thumbs up. Thank you so much and we'll chat soon.